talk through. This is how to ace Serpent Shrine. So you just want to pull that lever and then go up the stairs there. And then jump over that, jump um, onto the enemy to kill it. Now the snakes, there are snakes all over this level. You want to wait for them to pass and then jump over the gap. You do that with all the snakes. All the big serpents. Uh, get past all these enemies however you can, then bounce up to this platform, swing over, then go down into the snake path, then jump down to the lower platform. Kill the snake, it's got three little live things, then jump over the gap, jump over the fire, and bounce up, bounce up again, and bounce up a third time. Kill that enemy there if you want, you don't have to, then cross the bridge. Jump over that, kill the snake again. It's got snake it's got spikes on the front and back of it, so just be careful. If the snake's pass, then jump. Jump over that gap there as well. Jump over two gaps. Kill the enemy, then lower yourself down in the next level. Wait for the coals to fall after you jump over the gap, then jump over the gap again. Wait for the snake, jump over the gap, wait for the coals, jump over the gap. Then follow the checkpoint till you reach the next uh, level. Kill the snake. Wait for the coals so they can still hit you. Then jump over the gap. Wait for these coals as well. Then jump over the gap. Wait for the snake. Jump over the gap. Wait for the coals. Jump over the gap. Then wait for the snake and jump over the gap. Jump over this gap too. There's nothing there that can harm you. And jump over. Or kill the enemies if you want to. If you jump over the bridge like that, it won't collapse and you won't risk dying. Once you get here, just go down, then hold onto this thing. Then you can skip that one and just keep running, then go down to this one and get in the little checkpoint hole really quickly. Jump over it, go down to the next one, hold onto it, make sure you don't skid past it. Then uh, get off, jump, and swing over. Then you'll reach the um, boss. And here you want to do, you want to stand in the middle. After, after the first bomb lands, run towards it. You'll throw down a timed explosive. Push the timed explosive to the wall. Then do the same thing as before. And it'll blow up. Again, just push the timed explosive to the cardboard thing. Then just repeat this strategy over and over again until he's um, blown away to the next part. Then go through the um the thing. We'll throw more timed explosive if you can. Get to the other side. If you can't, then don't. You'll do it on. You'll throw bombs down on the right and middle platforms over and over again. I'll just keep alternating. So you just want to push the bomb over when he's not throwing bombs on the platform you're trying to push it over. If you are indeed going to die by getting hit by a bomb, or by the timed explosive exploding near you, then get, didn't just get away from it, because he'll just keep throwing them at you over and over again as they kill him. I think you only need about two bombs to kill him. Once you, you'll know he's going to die once this camera appears. You just want to hide in that little, um where I'm hiding there to avoid getting hit by debris. It killed me quite a few times when I was attempting to make this video. If you hide there you won't get hit by anything. And then once you finish the level without dying, that's it.